Breaking news in New Haven, SWAT stickers, and Donald Trump's name, along with swear words, painted all over inside of the Wilbur Cross High School Athletic Complex. News 8's Jason Newton is live tonight outside of the school with how police are getting involved. Jason. Yeah, that's right. And whoever is responsible for doing this, there's no obvious signs of how they got inside the athletic complex building here at Wilbur Cross High School. All the vandalism was done inside the building. Police released several pictures of what they say was found inside. New Haven police sent us at least nine images found on walls and equipment. All the images show swastikas. Some of them reference the name Trump and some contain foul language that we can't show on television. Police say the athletic complex was secured Saturday afternoon, that 48 hours later, the graffiti was found by staff members coming in to get equipment. Police say it's possible that a door may have been left unlocked. They also categorize this as hate-motivated behavior, possibly a hate crime, and the entire New Haven community is the victim of this crime. Now, police process the crime scene. They have no suspects as of yet, but they do ask for the public's help. So anyone with information is asked to call New Haven police. We also just got a statement from school officials here at Wilbur Cross. They said they're going to work closely with New Haven police to try to find out who is responsible for this. And there are still events taking place here on campus tonight. Students and uh, teachers and staff are scheduled for early dismissal tomorrow afternoon for the Thanksgiving holiday. That's the very latest live in New Haven tonight. Jason Newton, News 8.